Imposter syndrome uh, is something so many actors deal with anyway. Yeah. We, we cover well, but, um, but you know, especially back in the day when I was an unknown name and doing roles that, were not, that made me anonymous look-wise as well, uh, it took a while to get respected as, you know, like you said, a member of the cast as opposed to the freak in the cast. Right. So I think, you know, the first Hellboy movie is kind of what put me as a speck on the radar. Finally, like, okay, who's that? The gaining popularity of Hocus Pocus over the years since then has had multiple airings on television. And our original fans are having kids their own now. And now they're fans. So, so after the first Hellboy movie, then Pan's Labyrinth comes along. And then Hellboy 2, The Golden Army, then the Fantastic Four, Rise of the Silver Surfer, where even though they don't look like me, Sure. Uh, interviews like this have helped propel the the oh that's the guy that has done all those got it 